We didn't hear a peep when we first knocked. We thought no one was home. Well, I can't be too careful. If someone from the Academia came here looking for Alhatham, and I opened the door for them without thinking, before long the whole city would know that I'm living here. You're pretty conscientious about this, huh? So, what happens if someone comes inside looking for him while you're at home? It's fine, as long as I stay in my own room. Anyway, why would someone just barge in here looking for him? Most people have better things to do. Nah, fair enough. So do you know where he is at the moment? What do you think? Who knows what he does in his free time? All that matters to me is that he's out of the house. I wouldn't call it that. He's just incapable of saying anything pleasant at all. I told him how the second round went. I won the lot draw, remember? Because of good karma, of course. My luck's on the rise. But him, being him... Oh, you wouldn't believe what he said after I was done talking! You're always quick to remind me that you're my upperclassman, and yet you do not problem-solve in the manner becoming of an upperclassman. This begs the question of why we attach prestige to seniority at all. What does he mean, manner becoming of an upperclassman? What, am I supposed to earn the title of upperclassman now? And he didn't stop there. He said, I'd encourage you to reflect on why you've ended up having to rely on luck every round. Frankly, it's incomprehensible to me how you've managed to make it to this age without acknowledging the proverbial elephant in the room of your life. <laughs> yeah, that does sound like something all Hatham would say. I've had it with him. Every time I talk to him, it's the same way. He finds a way to infuriate me every single time. <sighs> Anyway, the disdain is very much mutual between us, so I'll be moving out as soon as possible. I'm actually packing my things right now. He'll have to get used to doing his own cleaning and tidying from now on. See those perfectly hung paintings on the walls? They're coming with me too. <laughs> if his life wasn't utterly devoid of artistic sensibility already, it certainly will be after today. Wait, you're moving out already? But the competition isn't even over yet! How can you afford it? Well, obviously I can't just yet. I'm just pecking early to get ahead of the game. I've got my new place picked out already. The moment I have my hands on the prize money, I'm going to buy it and move my things right in. It'll take me three days tops to move out of here for good. I now know what I have to do to achieve this goal. No matter what happens in the third round, I will win. I will emerge triumphant. You'll see. <laughs>